G'day, my name's Aaron Haynes. Um, I work here for Richard Brown at Bankhead Enterprises. It's a 750 acre block that we trade lambs and cropping and beef cattle. There's um, 700 ewes and then we carry anywhere between 1,500 to 2,500 trade lambs at one time. I started shearing when I was 17. Oh, I've competed for 15 years, obviously devoted a lot of my time to the Golden Shears and trying to win that and my goal was always to share for New Zealand and I did that in 2016. Shearing's a, it's one of those things you, you're always improving on and, and, and yeah it's been a dedicated probably passion of mine. Richard's had the Romney stud here for a number of years and um, they just sort of Cutting back from that and want to get more trading, finishing lambs to diversify with the cropping and trading lambs obviously comes with the numbers as well and um, they just wanted to be able to handle them easier, faster and just be more comfortable really and less staff obviously helps too. So trying to get all this set up is so that one man can do it all himself, yeah, it just makes the job a lot easier. It flows really well, like it's a, it's a simple design as far as setting up from a farming point of view. It's all about A, achieving the weight ranges and B, having it a one man job. So and that's, and that's what it does for us and that's what we're after. Those bigger prime lambs that are ready to go, they're a lot easier to handle through this. You know, you don't want to be dragging a 60 kilo male lamb across the board trying to dig it, so we do it in here and you know, it's quick and easy. You know, you don't even get a sweat up dagging sort of thing. Obviously we dirty clean them first and then just run them all through here, just with the foot pedal and we have a little handy piece set up, you know, just on your belt, just so you can keep moving around and push sheep up as you go. It's the fastest, easiest way to do it without any stress on yourself. Basically fill that pen up myself with a dog coming behind. She just sits at the gate just open up the gate into the race and then just basically use it use the flag to just keep pushing them up and um, yeah just bark your dog every now and again when you need to but once they get flowing and that and if I've got short wool they um, they don't stop they, they keep moving and it just makes it nice and easy and it's it's quick for the lambs because the idea of it's to to get the sheep in and out of the yards as quick as you can just so that they're not hanging around yeah, the remote's key really if you're on your own because you know you'll get the odd one that'll catch them early, uh, might have a foot off or something, so you can just yeah you can be five meters away and just you know release it, catch it again, it reweighs it, and then move on. So no, it's important to have the remote going definitely. It is a reliable machine. There's never any issues with it. You know, it's a solid built machine. It works definitely um, for what we want. Yeah, it's what you need for trading sheep. I, I think it's a must, yeah, yeah.